Identifying grey geese on the ground is fairly straightforward given good views. Four species of grey geese regularly occur in the UK. Bean goose, pink footed goose, white fronted goose and grey lag goose. With good views they can be quite easily separated from each other by a combination of bill and leg colour. The dark bill with extensive orange and the orange legs readily identified this bean goose. Two races of bean goose occur in the UK, tiger bean and tundra bean. The long swan-like neck and long bill confirm this bird as a tiger bean goose. Here we have a tundra bean goose. The restricted orange band on the bill identifies it as such. And the orange legs which can just be seen rule out the similar sized pink footed goose. Bean goose is a rare winter visitor to Britain but can be regularly found at two locations, the Yare Valley in Norfolk and the Slamannan Plateau near Falkirk. The rare tundra bean goose can occur in small numbers almost anywhere. These pink footed geese show the classic short stubby bills of this species, along with the narrow pink band and the pink legs that are unique to this small goose. The dark head and neck, contrasting with the pinkish breast, are also useful pointers. North Norfolk is one of the best places to catch up with pink footed geese, but they also occur in large numbers in Lancashire and parts of eastern Scotland and flocks can often be seen flying across the country. The all pink bills, combined with the bright orange legs, identify these birds as European white fronted geese. Only the adult birds show the blackish belly bands and white forehead. It is this that gives white fronted goose its name. White fronted goose also has a subspecies, the Greenland white fronted goose identified by its orange beak. This is always pink on the European white fronted goose. Regular wintering flocks of European white fronted geese can be found in North Norfolk and Slimbridge in Gloucestershire, whilst Greenland white fronted geese winter in Southern Ireland, the Solway Firth and Isla. Although Greylag goose shares its pink legs with pink footed goose, the large conical orange bill rules out all of the other grey geese. Wild grey lags breed in the highlands and islands of Scotland, but as a result of recent reintroduction programmes, they can now be found across large parts of Britain. Identifying grey geese in flight is a very different prospect. Once in the air, forewing colour and calls are all important. The trisyllabic ung uk uk calls identify these as bean geese. The darkish forewing helps separate bean goose from pink footed goose which shows a plain pale forewing. The dark head and high pitched wink wink calls are also good pink foot identification features. White fronted geese show an obvious pale line through the centre of the wing and the belly bars of the adult birds can often be seen. Note the pale wing bar on these white fronts that is absent on the single pink foot. The call has a high pitched yelping, yapping quality. In flight, Greylag shows the palest forewing and a dark square in the centre of the wing. It is also the palest goose overall. The call is the classic farmyard goose honk. <laughs> 